Hello, my name is Danny Mason. I'm the course leader for the Level 2 ICT course here at Newbury College. Uh, the course uh, is, is really kind of designed for students who want to enter the world of media or IT and want to work in that industry. The Level 2 ICT course will help them to get involved, to learn the basic skills and to help them to progress into, into that industry or into the kind of uh, more education. So being able to help them to get to level three, level four, and even onto sort of, uh, yeah, onto university. So you'll enjoy a wide range of subjects on the course. Uh, it's a mixture of media and IT subjects. Uh, with the media side, the creative side, you're going to be learning things with graphics, video, animation. With IT, you're going to be learning about things like uh, networking and how to maintain uh, your computer. So the facilities we have in college for the Level 2 ICT course are really, really good. Uh, we've got some dedicated uh, computer classrooms uh, and Mac suites which have all of the industry standard software such as uh, Adobe um, and we'll use that software which is up to date uh, to help support our learners and help them progress through the course and the key thing is, is getting them to learn software that they would use in the industry. So if you are interested in the Level 2 ICT course, um, please get in contact with us at the college. Uh, you can talk to myself uh, with either through a kind of telephone conversation or an email, and I'm more than happy to kind of talk to you about the course itself and go into a little bit more detail of what's it, what it's all about. So hope to hear from you soon. Hello, I'm Alan Tanner. I am the BTEC Extended Diploma in Information Technologies course leader here at Newbury College. What I'd like to do is take you through the course, what Newbury College can offer you, and basically what you can do in the future after finishing with us. We're progression focused, so basically everything is based around what you want to do in the future. We're employer led, so basically we have industrial replacements with excellent employers and the curriculum is influenced by businesses. We are skills based, so basically fewer exams, different types of assessment models. Um, so on the IT we do project based learning and there's practical subjects as well. Your study programme is based around vocational qualifications. So it's career focused qualifications that meet needs of the employers. If you need to do maths and English, they will be timetabled in, if you've been unfortunate not to get them as of yet. Uh, work related activities are built in and there's progression coaching within the college as well. There's a lot more to being a student than just studying. We have things in the college like the college cash point, we have a gym, fully equipped library, we have the NCS link through the National Citizen Service where we recommend students and whatever go off and do that during their downtime. We have on-site Starbucks and street diner, we have shows and exhibitions and then other things like student council etc. And also being a student you are able to get the student discounts with major brands. So on the BTEC Extended Diploma in Information De Technology, it's a two-year program of study with us. There's seven units in the first year and six are completed in the second year. There's no specific uniform equipment expected, but we do recommend that you utilise and buy the information technology put from Pearson's. We do try to take students out on trips. Um, they, they vary, basically the best ones at the moment that we can do are Bletchley Park. They've got two museums there where you've got the Coding Museum and then you've got the National Museum Computing. 
Both of those trips will be separated out so you can see both museums fully and you'll be able to see how computers have developed from basically the Second World War onwards. There's two exams in the first year. One is a written exam and the second one is like a project where you've got given a certain amount of time to do it in. It's normally about seven hours. And then you've got two units in the second year where they're similar to the external assessments where you get given time and they get asked you to do and develop things. Okay, the remainder of the units are assessed by assessment and that's where we do project-based learning as well and build that in. If you complete this course successfully with a very high qualification, you can go off to university. You could possibly stay with us because we do your HND, HND here, um, or you could go off and do a higher degree apprenticeship. Or, if you so want, you could go off to employment. So how can we help? Our tutors and support staff work closely together. So basically we've got local partners, so we can have got learning support, progression coaching, health and well-being advice, financial support including free travel, meals and help with childcare costs if they're so needed, and we've got a careers advice team here as well. And we'll also help you with university applications with UCAS, etc., if you so need to be, along with doing the references. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. My email is a-tanner at newbie-college.ac.uk. Thank you for listening.